Hello everybody, it is your boy Twin Plays here, back in our video, I hope you guys are all doing amazing. So recently we just left off with the Row Utilities Introduction and the Row Utilities Application Center. Now if you are here for the Rank Management Center, feel free to hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications, it means so much to me everybody. And um, I hope you guys kind of understood the last few videos, now if you haven't watched them, feel free to really go watch them because you're definitely going to need them. Um, we talk about how to sign up to Row Utilities and um, how to get everything uh, configured and ready for you so I actually haven't created a rank management center so we're actually gonna be doing this right away and um, yeah so let me pause this video we're gonna create straight into this um, I kind of forgot to explain one thing in the female rank application center or whatever you know just the application center of yours the automation right here is what's basically going to be the automatic ranking so on application received you want to just keep it at none and then when it gets accepted there should be a button that will tell you like which rank you can um, be putting in as in saying like which rank um, you want them to be ranked um so that's the that's the application thing that we need to configure later on so um yeah let's get straight into this all right so we're gonna just click new center right here and i'm just gonna call it um rank center you know i don't twins rank center let's just do that <laughs> just like we did the application center so i'm gonna click next um and we're gonna click manage on this and we are going to have a few things so it looks like how this works is um oh, all right so this is a rank center so we are going to be using game passes oh i see this okay so this center is basically be configured for game passes that's in saying people who buy game passes will be ranked a certain rank um so that's really that's really nice so uh we're gonna just you know configure this so you're actually gonna hit download roblox center right here and of course you have this right here. We're gonna just um, open this up and this is gonna you know, bring us to a new Roblox studio and we are going to uh, play this. Alrighty, so I got it took into this already. So you're gonna just hit game settings. You're gonna hit save to Roblox and we're gonna put it under your group. And I'm just gonna say this is the uh, rank center. So, you know, watch my tutorial on this. Um, so that's about it. It's save. And it will create this new thing for you, and it's going to load you back in just because that's how Roblox Studio works. And um, we will get started on this. Once that is loaded, we will just, you know, add a few things you can add into it. Um, but of course, we want to go to game settings, and we're going to want to enable allow third party teleports. And just click um, save right here, and that's about it. Let's get back onto the website. And while you're at it, make sure you actually make this public because, of course, my Dumbo did not make it public. And then click save, and um, that's about it. So now let's hop back to the applications. All right, so basically we're going to do the admin right here. And you're going to want to click this Roblox bot like we did last time. Hit configure, you know, put in that Roblox bot, which I already have my passwords to. So, you know, don't, don't worry, guys. <laughs> um, hit configure, you know, um, and it's going to be like... Oh, well, okay, well, it's going to do this thing. All right, let me just um, pause this real quick and let this see what this does. All right, so I kind of came on an error on there, so I'm going to go back and look at that in a second here, but you're going to click New Game Pass, and there's going to be a Game Pass ID, so I'm actually just going to go to my Game Passes that I made a long time ago, um, so I'll just, you know, do VIP. It's funny how there's so many cells. I like, you know, this game was crappy as hell. <laughs> so Game Pass, description, you can say, you know, this rank gives you... Um, let's say for mine uh, group, I'll say it gives you uh, super fan or something. All right, so uh, super fan, and then it's gonna put the rank, and well, you would do the rank right here, um, and then max uses would be just uh, should be just oh actually, you know what? I think one max uses. So I think this would be the number of uh, times they are able to buy this rank, like how many left there are. So I don't know if there's an infinity for that. Um, I think this would be like, I'm just gonna put 100, I'll just put 50 for now. Um, the rank part right here, I'm gonna have to talk to and see how that works, but you're gonna click save. Um, so I click success. Um, it should be able to, oh, did, it, did it save? Yeah, it saved. I think it saved. Yeah, um, we'll, we'll have to configure this in a sec here, but um, that should be just it. And then uh, let me figure this Roblox bot out real quick and see what's wrong. Okay, so I'm looking at this right now, 
and I did just realize there's been a bunch of updates to the website and there's an issue with the Roblox bot. So recently they used to have it where it was the Roblox uh, bot data I key, like key. Um, that's actually how we did it in the REPL. We actually used a data key from Google and we put it into the thing, but they recently just changed it. So I don't really know the issue to this, but what I want you guys to do is while you have these already set up, I basically showed you how to set it up and everything. Um, just wait till it's back up and running and you can just click this button right here. It honestly should be when I post this video. Um, you're gonna just click this right here, hit configure, get this um, bot set up and you can use, I'm pretty sure it's just a bot username and password. Um, and if they did change this back to the original um, thing with the data key, I'm gonna actually send you guys to this video right here. It is in the description and it'll teach you how to create that bot. Um, but you're basically, this is all you gotta do. You gotta put the game pass ID, you can click new game pass. Um, and then this rank right here, what's gonna happen, it should happen, is it will pop down all the ranks that they can get. So that's kind of a point of what how this should be working. And this is actually the same reason for um if we go to our uh application center over here and we go into here and we see we have this right here we have the admin so this roblox bot needs to be made and configured so of course right now it's just a little um needs needs some editing but when you go to automation when it, they get accepted there should be a bunch of ranks right here just click that one rank that they you want them to get and that's how that will work. So I hope you guys did enjoy these tutorials. Um, if you need more questions about this, let me know. I will probably be making another video with Roscriptor or sometime soon, basically on how to do this, um, how to do this on your own and, you know, scripting itself. But I'd really recommend checking them out. Feel free to check out all the links in the description. And um, yeah, you guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.